It's rant o'clock for me because you mentioned Tyree Sinclair, therefore you have lit the touch paper. I completely agree uh, that because he's got he's a confidence player and he's 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 an eager young lad. He's he's really eager to try and impress. So um, I think sometimes, like you say, I think sometimes he does think he's better than he is with with the free kicks. But when one of them, you know, does come off, it it will send you know shockwaves through. One thing he has got. Um, is a long throw and I was having a meltdown about this after the game yesterday because can somebody please explain to me the logic of bringing uh, a player on who's got a long throw on 72 minutes and then not using it until the 94th what is the point of that we've got we had at the 94th minute we had three players on the pitch no, four players on the pitch that are maybe over six foot. You've got Hewitt, you've got Rawson, um, you've got um, Hawkins who'd stayed on, and you brought Bowery on as well. Can, can you just Even... take Rawson out of that? Because <clears throat> he's, he's no threat in the attacking box. You know, he might, he might no, be right no. in the defence, but he's no, no threat in the attacking box. For once, I, no, for once, I'm going to defend <laughs> Farron Rawson because he's tall, and uh, the tallness depends on my argument here, right? <laughs> if you've got... If you've got, let's take Barry out of the equation because he came on a little bit later. At least three players over six foot who can be, who can, that's the, that's the, the key word, can mm. be dominant in the air. Every time you get a throw in line with their box or their or thereabouts and you've got somebody in your team capable of launching it in there and getting it to at least the penalty spot, use them every single time. Because I tell you what, they will not want to, A, they will not want to concede a throw, which means you'll have more opportunity to get across in the box and be more productive. But B, when they are facing a throw, every single time they see centre-halves coming forward, they know they're in for a battle. And it only takes one to drop to, to, to cause a chance and to cause an opportunity. We saw it when we had Exodus Cahegan. We saw it with Cheltenham last season, who, have, you know, who had Ben Tozza literally throwing them into League One. And now throwing money at them, courtesy of the movie stars, now at Wrexham, of course. And they'll use that to get out of the conference. If we've got it in our locker and Sinclair is capable of it, every time he's on the pitch and we get a throw in that position, get a long throw, even defensively, because when we were under, under the cosh, and you can't argue with this, I don't think, when we were under the cosh late on and we were trying to get that goal back, Clive, when we had a defensive throw in in our own half, he would launch it over the halfway line and we nearly created chances for it. If he's got a long throw and he's on the pitch, every time it goes out of play in those key areas, give him the bloody ball. Here endeth the rant. <laughs> we, uh, we don't disagree. I mean, if a, if a player's got a certain talent, it should be used. It should be exploited. Whether that be taking free kicks or corners or whether it be uh, um, throw-ins or whatever. Um, and, the, and the lad has got a surprisingly long throw for, for someone without the you know physical stature of, of someone like Ben Toza, who, by the way, I think has been recruited by the film stars because they think he's a quarterback. Um, <laughs> but we, uh, we, we don't always make the best use of our players. And I think if you're going to be critical of, of Clough, I think he, if, he knew, if he knows he can throw the ball in, why not, why not use him when we can? Um, I'm, I'm also not going to knock uh, Rawson. He is a presence, even if he's a clumsy presence when, when he goes into the box. Hey, it only um, takes a little knock. It only little, takes a little grace well, off it, his bold it, head, doesn't it, to go there's, in? There's That's one or, We'd all be there's loving one, him then. There's one or two players have to worry about him when he's there, and that just perhaps creates something for someone I'll, else. I'll give you that. I mean, The reason why I said it is we was having a laugh about it um, with, it, with the, the people I sat around with. Um, Ian was calling him the threat as a tongue-in-cheek but did say superb in the air defensively but going forward he's literally there as a presence but he's, he never seems to get anything close to getting a goal apart from when he played us and I think there are only two goals in his career so just uh, jump but, and get just jump and get a flick on and by except, do the rest he, he does give something for them to think about because there's someone else coming forward so I'll, I'll give I'll give you that little bit of a point but the point is if he's in there if he's in there in the season 10 times once It'll come off his arse and go in the goal. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to maybe rise that to 30 times and maybe once. All right, then. I'm not, maths isn't my strong, <laughs> strong yeah. suit well, here. Those, whether you're saying 20 or 30, that only depends on whether Tyree Sinclair is launching a long throw in end. That is my point. If we've got it, use it. You know what they say, if you've got it, flaunt <laughs> it. So that's that's the point that I'm uh, that I'm getting at a little bit. 